Hello everyone. This video is going to be about how the towers work within Run8 and within the external dispatcher and how you actually go about turning up the dispatcher. So within Run8 I'm going to pick a train here and this train that I've chosen is at Sanborn and the reason that I chose this is that it's within range of both UP and BNSF towers. So if I go to the external dispatcher application here is our train here and here are the two towers that we are within range of. This one is a BNSF tower and this one is a UP tower. So if I grab the train here, jump into the cab and we look at the radio. So the way you tone the dispatcher is first of all put the radio into DTMF mode, clicking this DTMF button and you'll see that the button has a slight red highlight once it's activated and you'll see up here the text telling you that you're in DTMF mode. So at this location at Sandbourne, to hit the UP tower, we turn star 54. And so you'll hear the tone back sound, and you'll see this text up here in Run 8 telling you that you successfully hit the tower. And then within the external dispatcher, this tower will light up. And that's what gets the dispatcher's attention. So from the dispatcher's point of view, you left click a tower to uh, uh, cancel the highlight. So to hit the BNSF tower now, we would hit star one, three. And that lights up the BNSF tower. If you hit shift F1 in the external dispatcher application, there are a couple of options here. Um, this one just determines whether or not the towers just light up or whether they flash and this one determines whether it'll show an initial for the railroad. So if I hit that tower again now, this time there's no B and it's just a solid light, so whatever you prefer. So I left click on that to cancel it. Also you should note that my radio right now is on channel 0, so every tower will work on channel 0. In addition to that, if you put the radio into channel mode, change to channel 13 and we say up here radio channel 13 when we go back to DTMF mode the BNSF tower will still work and there it lights up but the UP tower no longer does anything and that's because the UP tower responds to channel 0 or channel 54 so to be on the safe side within run 8 if you just have your radio on channel 0, uh, the nearest tower that will respond to whatever code you put in will light up. So if I go back to channel mode, put it on channel 0, and now I can turn up any of the towers. There is a, a range, so I can't hit any tower just anywhere on the route. I have to be within range of it, but it will generally light up whatever the nearest tower is. And the secret within Run8, if you don't see this message and you don't hear that tone back sound, then you didn't do it correctly. And that's pretty much all there is to toning the dispatcher.